Keontae Ingram, let's not kid ourselves. Keontae Ingram is not a fantasy option, not even a secondary fantasy option. Yes, he had some nice metrics, 70th percentile 40-yard dash, 80th percentile speed score, 76th percentile bench press. But the reality is Keontae Ingram, not very good. Last week, he only had 13% of the snaps. He had three carries, one red zone carry, ran 11 per. 0.6% of the routes, five routes total. He had seven total yards. He finishes running by 59 with 0.7 fantasy points. Not an option. Like, don't get cute. He's not even a handcuff. Okay. If if Connor doesn't play, then it's gonna be, as we saw in week six, it's gonna be the Eno Benjamin show. So let's not say Keontae Ingram, go stash him. No, just leave Keontae Ingram on waivers. Like, it's okay. And I'm willing to say, like, he's not even a fringe option. I'm moving him way down from running back 57 to running back 74. I think there are other running backs with better handcuff upside anyways, right? Like, if you think about it, Corey Clement is on the practice squad, and so is Tyson Williams. Like, they'll be bumped up. And I don't think I would move Keontae Ingram very much at all if James Conner is ruled out. 